What's going on YouTube? Kuyu here bringing you a brand new series on the channel. Been looking forward to this series for quite some time. I'm not alone today. I have a very special guest. A guest who is shrouded in mystery. That one and only creature known as the Sasquatch. We call him Gavi Sauce. Hey everybody and welcome. Hi YouTube. I'm kind of here behind him. I think this is the angle you're using. I it could be wrong. I'm very, very stupid Pretty close. about all this. But um, yeah. Welcome to uh, Minecraft. I think you all know kind of what this is anyway, but you know, it, it, it's what it is. It's good. And, and for um, your viewers who do not know who I am. Um, yes, this, for those of you who don't know, uh, is Kuya, formerly known as Dragix. Uh, ignore the SGA for a moment because uh, well, that has yet to be completely explained, but it will be soon. It's something that may or may not have been teased multiple times by multiple of our videos as ever. Uh, Indications of times and things like that. It's coming up. And, uh, You'll see. Yep. <clears throat> yep. It's 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 <clears throat> mostly a good thing. Anyway. Behold. As for today, we are yes. starting off at spawn. It's somewhere around back that direction ish. We're around it somewhere. Yeah, for those of you who are wondering, it's like right over here. On my video at least. His you'll never know. Oh, <laughs> I've already there, left the There. There he is. I've already left. Anyway. And uh -huh. this is Gabby Sauce's house. He built this house, actually he built this house to start off when we started, yep. all this is done on survival, then mm -hmm. he upgraded to this masterpiece. Wait, yeah, for, for, for maximum viewing effect, you kind of have to come back over this way, and right about here, alright, okay, that, I'm coming. Uh, you, uh, except for the, the, the little storage shed is kind of <laughs> in the way, but you know. Well, you can climb up on one of these cacti if you want. Well, I can't do that. Hey, there's an arrow. It's, I want that. It's, it's big. It's bombastic. It's, it's beautiful. beautiful. <clears throat> uh, anyway. He um, built this for one primary purpose. And that mm -hmm. is when we do have people come on. They have a place to start. That way they don't just kind of spawn in at nighttime and, you know, die. die. Yeah, it's not a good so, thing. Why um, don't you give us a tour? All right, well, first of all, welcome to the ground floor. As you can see, we have made the walls and the foundation out of a very sturdy brick. The ground floor here is a 16 by 16 area, and the floor is a fine checkered pattern, alternating from light to dark to darker to darkest, uh, of the four different kind of woods which are available in the Wii U version of Minecraft. Uh, as you can also see here, on our chandeliers to kind of help light this up, because we were having some spawn issues down here. Um, torches for days, uh, and the central, I think I mentioned this before already, but if I haven't, I'm going to mention it again, the central pillar, the central pillar here is sort of indicative of the name of the house, which is the House of Four Trees, I wonder, yeah, anyway, if you come up here, you, uh, will enter into the spruce level of the building, which is the darkest, you can go through these doors, and it's basically just kind of like a little observation deck, shows you all the way, uh, you can see a, uh, a village out there on the western bank or the western side. Uh, there's also another desert village. You can kind of see some buildings from over those trees there uh, towards the, the eastern side, slightly southeast past the river. Um, that's also kind of the direction where uh, someone has already built, but I'm not really sure if they want their name mentioned in this video, so I won't. Um, anyway, uh, we go back inside here. Like I said, this is kind of sparsely decorated. Uh, this is actually like the least, I mean, I, I, I do kind of like this darker strip I did along the top here and everything. I'm going to do my better homes and gardens impression. Um, but yeah, if you go up here, you enter into the um, the jungle level. Uh, also, note these pillars here on the sides. These pillars actually stretch from the f ground floor all the way up past the ceiling of the top floor. Uh, they're kind of like just support beams and things like that to keep everything up, and because they're jungle, they match in very well with this level. Um, oh, yeah, I just fell in a hole. Okay. What are these these side rooms? These side rooms are very sparse and are actually probably in need of a little bit of rework. We just did a test on that, and uh, actually when you sleep in these beds, you either end up outside or on the floor below you. So in the interest of that not happening to any future guests, uh, we'll be fixing that shortly, but for the moment, but this is kind of like the what you can expect if we should decide to let you on, in, onto the server. Uh, if you want to stay here, there's a bed, there's a double chest, there is a 
work, work, a workbench and a furnace and some nice night lights to make sure you don't get scared by mobs. Um, and, Very anyone nice. who, and anyone who's kind of taking up residence, uh, you can certainly change, add your name onto the little uh, signposts. Uh, I'm probably just going to move these over like one or two. I'll probably move these over like two levels um, just to create a little bit more room and maybe put like another double chest or something in there so people can have uh, room for their stuff. Anyway, up to the next floor. You'll, you'll notice that this uh, pillar extends without uh, throughout, and uh, it's very nice. This mm -hmm. is my second favorite level. Um, it's it's very nice. This is your oak level. Each of the uh, four corners has one of these mini observation decks, which was a pain in the butt to actually get right to like view and be on because there was some difficulties with the floor below and how I wanted it all to work together, and yeah, that's that's. But in the end, it does have a spectacular view. I, I do. Uh, I do kind of wish that there was a different biome here, other than I mean, if you go, you can actually kind of see some of the low rolling hills way out there towards like the northeast um, of the the plains biome. I wish that was actually extended all the way down here because I love the plains biome. Um, yeah. I actually have a small outpost way over there on the northwest uh, in another plains biome, which I use to try and catch horses, but I've only ever gotten uh, the one down there in the uh, nice diamond armor that was so generously given to me for all the good things that I do on the server, which is absolutely nothing. But that's another story, except for I died the first yeah, 15 yeah. times. And that is not and an exaggeration. I died the no, first 15 it, times really just not. by myself. Yeah, uh -huh. all Also because in one day, pretty much. Yeah, all well, in one, one day, all the regular day. day. Mm -hmm. And also, this, this chest is very important. Uh, it commemorates building in a taiga biome and about all the snow we had to remove from it during the build. Well, about the quarter of it is here in this chest. Um, so, yeah. Also, pay attention to this ceiling because this is also the floor of the floor above. And I could have done double stacked floors so that we could have had it completely encased, but I kind of like how one leads into the other like this. So that is very although, nice. Very nice. Although it would have made it a lot easier to do had had we double stacked at least this one. And I'm sure Kuya here will definitely agree with me on that because he helped me do it. No <laughs> arguments a, here. This was a royal pain in the butt to do. <laughs> Any, you look at the size of this building. The whole building in general is a pain in the butt to do when you're doing a completely survival server and uh, all i did was just a little bit here and there on the top floor gabby sauce did all the rest of this by himself uh you'll also notice out here uh on the on the western side of the building there is this large kind of cleared plain um with a bunch of like bumps and hills and stuff that was where i grew trees for about eight days um just lots and lots and lots of trees as you can imagine this floor required more trees than any other thing on this server, and I don't feel like that is an, all an exaggeration to say. Not at in all. Any, in any way, shape, or form. Uh, this was stupid hard to build <laughs> because you had to first place all of the horizontal blocks, and then you had to place all the vertical blocks. <sighs> but as you can see, the roof is also a mirror image of the floor down below. Um, there's nothing else up there, uh, just sort of the pillar, and then these, these side pillars, like I said, they extend up there. And I like this because it's nice and broad, and you have a nice view wherever you look. Um, you really I'm do. I just, I am a little disappointed that I'm surrounded by desert. Um, you can actually see a place over there where I strip mined before, or I've tried to strip mine before. Uh, we won't talk about how badly that ended. <laughs> but it most likely ended with lava. That was day two. Um... I am probably personally responsible for more than like five percent of all of this server's diamonds being just lost to lava, um, <laughs> because we only have eight sixty four by eight sixty four, and uh, I found a bunch of diamonds and have died in lava with a lot of them in my possession. Um, yeah, so uh, we have some ender chests here, and we have uh, my furnaces up here. Which ah, my potatoes are done. I'm good. I'm very glad about that. Uh, oh, I got some more levels. Or yeah, let me go and actually drop the full stack in here. I'll just keep these 21 on me. Um, as you can see, I'm kind of geared out, and actually, so is Kuya wherever he went. There he is. Come here. And um, I'm gonna let him tell you why that is. And uh, we can, let's not. We will explain uh, that right after we hit the next place. If you would like say, to. Uh... Oh yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna hit. 
I don't know where we're going to head to. I was going to head to one of your little guest rooms and go to sleep. Oh, well... It's dangerous out there. I was going to say, you do realize you're going to get, like, dropped through the floor again, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, well. Okay. Well, I'm going to sleep in my bed, because, I mean, I, I was going to, like, move them apart, because I know it's not, like, really cool to do, you know, sleep next to another guy, so... Um, but, yeah. Well, anyway, this, this is all part of the adventure. You get to true, stay here, true. and then you get in a night... Oh, guess what? I didn't die. Wow, that's impressive. Um, uh -huh. I want my money back. I, I was guaranteed to fall through the window. No, it was Great just a wake-up call. Just a it's such a good wake-up sure. call, though. And do remember, though, if you hit me, uh, the dogs will kill you. Um, yeah. Been there, done that. Bad times. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I, before we go before we go anyplace else, we have to introduce them to Holstein. Fine. I do All not right. have my horse with me, so... Right. Um, We're going to have to walk to my house. Oddly enough, yeah. I do have Bane of Arthropods on this sword, so... <laughs> Rip in pieces, spider. Um, uh, yeah, so Holstein is kind of like uh, an accidental server mascot. We really need to like tie him down somewhere. Yeah. But uh, um, well, actually, probably like right there because then otherwise, otherwise, he wouldn't really be Holstein. But Holstein, he has been here since day one. Yep. And, and he uh, has never have, left that spot. And we haven't had the heart to kill him or move him or anything else, and we're still not going to. Uh, we're actually probably going to end up naming him and. Uh, not and like, well, uh, tying him up to a post here or something, or probably like over here, so that we yeah. can always have Holstein with us. I uh, mean, he's just become part of the family. Yeah, he's the tastiest part of the family, but we're we're not <laughs> going to eat him. Yeah, I mean, we have plenty of other things to eat. I don't need the spider eye, so uh, yep. I don't really need this either. So, Gabby takes ready. advantage of the villages. He's got two of them right beside him, and so he raises potatoes at their place. Yep. And keeps my place nice and uncluttered, except for, you know, all the very uneven terrain. Uh, where are we headed next to, by the way? We're going to head over to my house. Okay, then I'm going to ride my horse, because I like my horse. My horse is awesome. I can't say that I blame you. In I should have rode mine over. But honestly, me running is probably faster than me riding my horse. I have the best horse on the server... Uh, which is not saying much because there's currently only two owned horses on the server because we're having some spawn issues. Um, which and is like I, I said, mine is slower than me running, so. Yeah, yeah. So, um, but well, that's kind of why I built the other outpost way over there. Um, and don't worry, there is actually a point to all this. We're not just showing off the server, although that I mean, we could just kind of split up into videos, but we're probably just going to just forge ahead and do it all. Yeah, anyway. Why not? Uh, I wanted you to see what Gabby's been working on. Oh, oh! by the way, people watching my video uh, and people watching Kuya's video you might want to come over to my video specifically for this because this right here on my screen presented as I'm speaking is a spawn, is a loading glitch, and the only way to fix it is for me to log out and log back in. Uh, but we're just going to let that be because at first I, I came, first time I came across one, I thought it was like some massive hole in the world and it was awesome and I could get all the ores in it. And I was wrong. And that's how more of the this server's diamonds were lost, never to be seen again. Um, and as far as people looking at my screen, which I'm sure Gavi will pass this too, but you see that, that big, massive thing floating in the sky? Big looking yeah, tower? That is not my house. Yeah, we're, we're, they can see it now in my... Um, they can see Just it so you know, that is not my house. Building up, in, you know, a, a little bit of a time. In that fact, is we can't actually even the see it up even... there. We just kind of see the, the path up. You see oh, there the we face. go. We found it. Uh, that is a mob spawner, so we could have some different things going on. Get some arrows and bones. I have a bad question to ask you. Okay. Do you have a lead around here that I could borrow? Oh, I forgot to bring one. Uh, yes. Okay. Let me run because... inside and. Because Get it. I'm looking the... down because I don't want no one to see the rest of this until we are ready. Right. Yep. Not there. There it is. Because I have the best and fastest horse on the server. Um. Yeah. He likes to leave. He, you can literally runs. walk inside, walk outside, and that horse will be gone. Yep. Yeah, and you can see my horse. I did not put diamond armor armor on my horse because uh, there's no point. He's well, slow and boring. I, I tell you what, you've you've helped me a lot with that diamond horse armor. One of these one of these days, I will get on here and I will catch you a decent horse. How's that? 
that'll work. So, backing up here, you can see my house. Oh, I, I just charged in without asking permission. I'm so sorry. Yep, I'm well, already trespassers inside. shall be shot. I'm putting a sign up. I'm hiding. You'll never find me. Uh, here's my house. This is what I did. It actually didn't start off as my house. We will get to my original house to begin with. Sorry about yeah. all the mooing. Uh, here's yeah. my mob's my mob spawner. You go up there, you stand, mobs fall, you click stuff. You know how that goes. Mm -hmm. Then you hit a button, and you fall down this other side, and you fall through the water so you don't die. One of the reasons I needed the uh, mob spawner is I needed bones to make bone meal for an automatic wheat farm so I could start an automatic cow cooker. I enjoy my cow cooker. You that bring wheat up here. You feed the cows. Little babies pop down. They fall in. And they're just small enough where they don't burn to death. But as soon as they grow up, they they fall in the lava. You hit this. All of them fall or get pushed into the lava. They cook and you get cow leather and steaks. I enjoy steak. So do I, but I don't have this fancy setup, so I just kind of make do with baked potatoes. Well, I made this one... A little wider than it's originally meant to be. I don't. None of my stuff is actually original. I just kind of design it and add to. I just widen this one. And thanks to the Wii U, I'm only allowed so many animal spawns. Go back. So it's I, bigger than enough, it needs to be. Oddly enough, I found this out that um, uh, cows you can have more of than chickens, which is very odd. Very odd. Because you can so only here are my dogs. I got Tori and little buddy. And he actually has them named. I don't. Uh, Here's I've my been... fireplace that I don't ever catch on fire because I've had way too many bad incidences. Very bad. It's, a, it's very nice. I mean, if you maybe if you bought it out a little bit, but sewn out a little bit more, you could you could do that. But um, probably. Yep. But upstairs is very barren. Nothing really up here. I don't ever come up here, but it's one of those things. Hey, why not? You got the nice little horsey. deck. I like my deck. Good view. Not as nice as Gabby's view, but hey. Well, it's okay. I, I paid the extra the extra um, money to uh, get the view. Oh, aren't you going to take it on yeah. the third floor? Uh, the ladders? I did. Oh, okay. I, I wanted to show them around. Back here. But the main floor is where chimney. everything kind of starts. But, every, but no, everything happens in the, uh, in the basement True. here. Left the door open. Oopsie. We'll start off over... Uh, stop it. Buttons. Well, no, I left it open too. Oh. I had an automatic furnace right here. Matching this, I'm a very symmetrical person. This is where I started off with all my stuff. Then I came down here, and I built an automatic sorting room. With an automatic which, furnace going into it. Which may also be known as the most colossal waste of time on the server because you have to be able to fill every spot in every chest for it to work and I do not have, I spent all my resources to build this and now they don't I don't have enough to fill them up <laughs> I'll take I'll show you a sneak peek back here <laughs> we'll move that just give you a sneak peek get the redstone behind it I love redstone I'm personally a redstone fanatic You'll so. also notice that there is none of this cool stuff at my house because I don't have the patience. <laughs> he he doesn't have the patience, but he builds that monstrosity, and he has oh. a uh, he had I have to say he had another project going on in PE that has, takes more patience than anything I could ever do. Well, okay, I I have I have the patience if I can see if I can do something that I can see will create consistent results or that will have consistent progress going all the time with redstone it's basically all trial and error over and over True. and over and over and over and over and over again and every time i get something wrong i get madder and madder and more angry and more <laughs> upset it's like i don't want to do this anymore and so i give up and i just start building gigantic things or digging gigantic crazy holes which will get lost forever when your save is corrupted um, yeah, he had big hole 2015 going. He was going to build was big tower 2016 and save corrupt. Yeah, that was such a sad day. But may it rest. We may must it rest move on. So, 
We have come to my automatic wheat farm. This is actually designed by Etho. You stand on here. Gabby Saw still hasn't figured out the timing. I have not. And then you just plant and you hold. All three dispensers down there have the uh, bone meal in them. That is why I needed all the bones. And it's as simple as it gets. You just sit there and do that. I will say, though, that I just benefited from your hard work. Um, you got like some of my wheat? I do. Uh, sure. I will throw it into my cows. And then coming over here, we this have is... what every house needs. Oh, I, I'm Spoilers. Sorry. I, left, I left it all extended. I'm so sorry. I don't matter. They're going to see it anyway. You yep. have the enchanting room. In fact, in which this case, is the only enchanting room on the server at the moment. Um, and the best. Not just You hit default. the lever. You hit the lever, the bottom shelves come up. You hit this lever, the top ones come down. That way you can have all three different levels of enchanting. And one of these days we will have 1.8.8 and we will be able to use lapis and books and all that stuff. So I put a chest up here to take care of everything in here. And we may also be able to enchant uh, fishing rods, which I have tried to do and I don't think it's possible. Oddly enough. Hmm. Uh, one of these days. Found that out on my world. I'm locked in. No, no. And all this actually was not here to begin with. My house actually originated right down here. You hit this button. I'll show you. Here we go. Brace yourselves. Oh, there we go. And we're safe. This is where my house actually started. I had a clock here. My bed was here. I had all my chests over in this little area. I mean, I just loved it down here. I had everything. This is this is my uh, water. It never goes dry. Endless you water mean supply. Water source. Yeah, that thing. Natural lighting, natural mineral deposits and formations. Very, very, uh, very uh, rugged design here. Uh, yeah. This was the original. Yeah, this was the original enchanting room. It was. It got tore apart because I needed all my stuff back. May it live on in our memories. Um, then this was my original sugarcane farm, which I still have not built an automatic one for, but I will. I will. Here's my strip mine. Uh, again, uh, natural lighting. Uh, no protection on this one. Uh, so. No. This is a place we will oh. never go. I did not even notice that you uh, had a strip mine here. This is like new information for me. Um, oh yeah, that's I don't that's know how been I there missed since that day one. one. We are not going in there, but we are auto saving. Oh, oh wow! Already. <laughs> My Minecraft world is set to save every thirty minutes just to be safe. Mm-hmm. But you come over here just a little bit more. I am glassing in all this lava. There is a massive lava lake that just keeps going. And it will eventually all have glass on it as well. Why? Well, why not? I've got the time. So. And he has the inclination. Yes. But this oh, is where my house originated. And then I finally, when both Gavi had his house. And the other person who shall not be named unless he decides he wants to be named. Mm -hmm. Then we'll name him. If uh, they got their houses built, and I'm like, okay, that's uh, probably a good idea for me to actually build a house. And I'm pretty happy with the way my house turned out. Uh, I, I will say this, though. I had started my house. I'd gotten to the second floor before he started building his actual house. And he still finished his house about two days before I finished mine. But you see how big his is compared to mine. We need to sleep. We do. Why? Because we are not ready to die yet. Yet. Okay. <laughs> oh, how yes. key that operating phrase is. Uh, well, I, I say that because I guess it's time to tell everybody why we are. Wait, 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 wait. What wait, we're wait, going wait, wait, to wait. do? Not yet, not yet, not yet. No, no, no. Not yet. Oh, For, okay. Because, because, um, I figure we're gonna take the horses over there, and we can park them at the at the ranch. And while we park them at the ranch, we can uh, show them that briefly. Okay. Right, so. Oh yeah, I forgot I've got doors out here. Yep. Let's see. And here. so, the 
I don't have a map on me right now. You're actually spawning in with one on Wii U version, which is very, very helpful. The only very. trick is um, I keep dying and losing my map. And, and I just put mine up one. just in oh, case oh, oh, I die. Oh, also, that is the uh, witch hut that we have been like avoiding like the plague. Um, I don't actually know if there's one yeah. in there right now. I'm not going to find out. Uh, so kind of the best way to do this is we just kind of go a little bit south here. Oh, I'm not going to get through that tree. That is for sure. Uh, I'll go over this way. And go down this way. And hello, Mr. Creeper. Let's not play with you right now. <laughs> because that's um, what you want to do. You want to run into a creeper. Yeah. All right. And then we can come this way. Oh, wow. This is just not working out really well, is it? Now I, I don't know, know what your I... problem is. I'm having fun. No problem. I've made mistakes. Wait. See? Horse? No. Nope. Horse? All right. Come on. This way. This way, horse. Good horse. Going across the water. <laughs> oh, yeah. We've got leads. I forgot about those. We certainly do. Give it back. No horse, don't go back in the water. Man. My horse is more obedient than his horse. Uh, well, mine's more spirit and goes faster. <laughs> yeah, well, no argument. And jumps there. a whole lot higher. Mine cannot jump, nor can it run. It pretty much just sits here. Yeah, pretty much. There's, there actually is a more efficient way to get from where we were to where we're going. Uh, and this is not it. Wow, I just found a cave. Um, there are we? But, yeah, but where's but, the fun in that? Hey, guess what I just found? Uh, my original strip mine, or something like that. No, no, it's not it. There's a, I don't know, but there is a crafting table. Uh, it's probably connected middle. with there. it. Did a, something blow up around here? It's oh, no, my original one's over here. Over here somewhere, yeah, over that way, and something to pull yeah. up. But uh, you can see the small bit of extreme hills we have. Uh, that's it. <laughs> Sadly, there's not more. I love the extreme hills. It's one of my favorite biomes. That's where I built on my server, but unfortunately, I did not. I found a cool mountain, but didn't really plan it out very well on um, exactly how that worked out. So, um, it's I can get I can get there, just really can't get back out to any place else on my map. So it's a little frustrating. But uh, no, I left we you. Learn, we try again. I say I'm actually I just put my horse in the corral, so I'll be wow. back down there in a second. Which uh, way is the just, corral from here? I've only actually been there once. Uh, it is. I don't know where you are, but it's oh, like it was... just south of the main mountain of the extreme hills. So if you can see the yeah. you can see the main mountain, you can find it. It's like north of wherever you are, I'm sure. Um, I just want to show them the little ranch here. Uh, it may need a little bit of work. Um, this is I just may let you do that them. because I can't find it. See, this lost. is this is the uh, this little strip here is just to mess with all the OCD people on the server. I am not that one, so I get to mess with them. And it's nothing really all that special here. Uh, I just have couple stacks of stuff which may come in useful in just a second and again a couple beds here um, or people still get, get messed up and I'm actually going to leave my lead or not my lead but Kuya's lead in here I just steal everything uh, that's what I do and uh, I remember thinking now I should have brought a pickaxe but too late for that anyway where we're completely going lost. you're completely lost do you have your map on you no. Okay, that's I was in front of where we were going. I do know where we're headed. Okay, so if you can go to the junction, where? what biome are you in right now? I'm in the plains, right on the edge of the uh, for, or the jungle. Okay, yeah, that's where you need to be. Um, but remember, mm, it's, but farther, it's farther north than we thought it was originally. Uh, oh, there it is. So, Found it. Yep, okay. Uh, we so. built the best, most magnificent descriptor of the place that we're going to, and I'm pretty sure most people can figure it out by this point, where I'm headed to. Um, there's Kuya right up there. Um, and it, it is just mind-bogglingly beautiful, and you cannot see it on my screen. I'm sure you can on his, and now you can kind of see it on my screen, as you can see. 
it's just a couple of gigantic stone arrows pointing at some stairs. <laughs> there we go. I built my own corral. Oh, you brought a fence post with you? No, I dug a hole. Oh, oh. that works too. Yep. Got to have the arrows pointing. Yep. Where yeah. we're going. Yep, just absolutely professional signage right there. Um, by the way, did Eventually, you fix the staircase? No, 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 okay. don't, don't jump down, yep. don't jump down. <laughs> Just you will eventually be able to jump straight down the middle of this, but I made um, a boo boo at the very bottom. It couldn't have been a boo boo at the very way. top. Yeah, it couldn't have been a boo boo at the top. That would have made nope. things too easy. Yeah, absolutely. All we're going to wall all this in, mm -hmm. and you can already see where we're heading yep. with that stone. It's in here, nothing. Okay, good. And I brought a little bit of stone along, uh, stone along with me in case you need to build up at all. And uh, believe it or not, we do actually have the end in this version, and it does work, and it's beautiful. Leave this stuff. Um, Don't need it. Does everybody know what happens in the end? I do. We all die. How do you um, do? I have my arrows. I have, so basically, let's do a rundown of what we have. Uh, I okay. have an Aqua Affinity 1 projectile protection 1 helmet. I spent five levels apiece on all of my armor, and as you can see, I got practically nothing for it. I also got protection, protection one on my chest plates, protection one on my leggings, protection one on my boots. Uh, I spent 25 levels on my bow. I would have ground out for 30, but I got bored and didn't want to do it anymore. And so I got power three, and then I have Bane of Arthropods one and knockback one on my sword, which is probably not going to get used all that much. Uh, but yeah, go ahead. Me, I spent three levels on each of mine, and... Honestly, he still ended up with better stuff. I got protection one on my diamond helmet. I got projectile protection one on my diamond chest plate. Blast protection one on my leggings. Blast protection one on my diamond boots. And then I spent three levels on my sword. I went ahead and made a diamond sword because I had leftover diamonds. We got smite one. And then I spent 30 levels on my bow, hoping for that infinity. And I only ended up with punch two and power four. Then I've got some arrows and that's pretty much it. So, he overall just has better stuff than I do, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, but you got protection one on all your stuff, so... No, I don't, actually. I just have it on two pieces. The other one's a projectile. Oh, well, so. two's still better than one, so... All right. Now, does anybody want to take a wild guess at what we're about to do? Well, I know, so I can't really, you know... Uh, wait! Before we do it, in the comments down below, with the timestamp of when this is in the video, because I honestly have no idea, mark I when you created your comments, minutes. and, well, you didn't have to tell them that, because then the people can cheat. Tell us what you think we're about to do, and we'll move on and do it. Anyway, we're going to do that anyway, but yeah. Yeah, I think we'll have a better question of the day. But would uh -huh. you like to count down until our jump? Me? Why, yes. Okay. Would you like a standard countdown or something extra special? Well, this is a very special episode, being it's the first one of something we are going to talk about while we fight the dragon. So let's do a special countdown. Okay, let me think of a special way to do a countdown. One, two, three, go. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I can't see. Oh, there we go. I had a glitch just... where it looked like I fell into lava, and I just picked up a wooden sword, and how did those get yeah. there? Just so you know, we have been down here before. Yeah. We won't talk we... about those escapades either. Uh, it was not the And best you know what's times. missing? What? Everything. I don't know what it is. The end will not keep my stuff. I had a Good. ender chest down here. I had two double chests. I had a crafting table and a furnace. And Wait, no, no, no. Really Didn't we move swell. those up? We... No, no, no. We moved them up. We moved them up. Did we move there... them up? There should be up here. But they're not. See? Oh well, wow. we don't need them. That's that's not good though. Because uh, aren't we oh, just well. aren't we just like running through ender chests every time we come in here? Yeah, but you know, after this, we will have all the ender. The ender we never want. Yeah. Although, so uh, there's one there's one problem with that. What's that? You need eye of ender to get an ender chest. Oh yeah, and the nether on here is. Oh. Death. There's a just, reason just we didn't go in death. there. There's a really good reason we didn't go in there. I still have nightmares. Actually, you know what? You know what? Uh, before we before we get started here, I just pop you a good one here. I want to get an, uh, at least like one ender pearl in case I get knocked off the edge. And try and 
do like a last That is save. a very smart idea. I hadn't even uh, thought about something like that. That my my moment of my my single moment of intelligence. Did you get one? Well, right. No. While we're doing this, I guess we could throw it out there that I've been playing Minecraft for less than a year now, not super long. But before that, I hadn't even... I, well, I'd heard of Minecraft, but I didn't care one bit about it. And Gavi Sauce, on the other hand, has been playing for a whole lot less than that, but has been keeping up with it for a whole lot longer than I have. Right, uh, I got me an Ender Pearl. That, that's an that's a understatement. I've been keeping up with Minecraft almost since it first launched, but I, I only was able to play it for the first time ever on the Pocket Edition in... Um, September, I no, it was end of November because I didn't get uh, a, a decent enough device to run it on until uh, November. So, yep, I've been playing a grand total of about three and a half months now. I got this one. So we are Bam! both pretty well. Whoa, hello, both yep, new. He's here and he's angry, and some of these will have cages on them. Uh, so we're going to be a little oh, yeah. aware of that. That one has actually been taken out already because uh, I built up there. I think with endstone. I think it's on the other side. Let me run over here real quick. Uh, let's make sure it is this well, one. While he's doing yeah. that, I want so you I to may... see something. And I, I want you to I... notice something about this here dragon. Oh yeah, it's not a normal dragon. Oh, it's not a normal dragon. Ender dragon is not under Ender. Oh, anatomy. did do you see that? Do you see that stuff coming from his mouth? Uh, I did. Yeah, it, didn't. my stream did, or not my stream, but my, um, my did it. But uh, that's okay. They'll catch up. Oh, they, they, they're oh. trying to see it. I do apologize for my video quality, guys. I do try and have better better quality than this, but uh, I'm a scrub, and uh, I don't have it. Right. Got that one. Okay, guess only one of these has a cage on it. That's a good thing. Uh, anyway, the oh. one that has been taken out already, uh, I did that. I built up there and hit it with a sword, and thereby killed myself. But um, it was such a momentous occasion to finally get here that I felt it was... Worth, worth, uh, at least taking uh -huh. out one of them. Yep, I'm really quite, Gee, good, be quite good at that. Whoa, what is he? What is this stuff? Back away. Bad Ender Dragon. As you'll notice, he, this dragon spits fire. He spits fire, and not only does he spit fire, he spits fire balls. Making things uh, a little more complicated. Didn't really figure I believe that starts with the uh, 1.9 update, doesn't it not? Uh, on the PC it does, yes. And yet, Which we don't is. even have 1.8, and we yeah. get it. Ooh, missed that one by a long shot. Uh, I kind of need to get up there Ow. a little bit. I'm about he to got do me. something stupid. Just letting you know. Oh boy, I'm going to get stuck fighting this thing alone. You can no, pretty you well mark Gavi's words. When he says I'm about to do something stupid, it's usually not very long. Whoa. Oh, I just Before realized something. I can't, I, I can't even do that because I, I didn't bring a pickaxe. So, nope, not going to do that. I just have to try and find a way to shoot this thing. Uh, that's the one that's in the cage. Uh, it's not really a, an effective... Uh, I'm trying to get the one he's healing up. Ah, wrong button. Healing up with, and I can't seem to... I need a little. Kind of halfway build up here. I'm going to do it this way. So Come on, now. Better angle on it. Let's see. Oh, I think there's a hole in that cage right there. I think. I'm probably wrong. Oh, it's been so long since I've used a bow on this game. There we go. I need uh, to be careful with my arrows. cages, but that one is open. Yeah, we can handle the cages. That's not a problem. As long as there's not too awfully many for him to heal with. Uh, I need... I can't... <sighs> Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? Oh, it's too... just so close. Right there... <laughs> Let's drop nope, the wooden overshot. sword. Alright. Oh, I'm now. so close. Second. Uh, While this is going on, you oh. think now's a good time to tell them? Could be. Ow! That fireball. This really is the beginning. Help. Of a brand new series that we are going to start called. Would you like to tell them? Lost in Minecraft. 
Destiny. This is going to be a, a dual survival game. We are going to set ourselves some goals. And we've got... Did we decide on 25 days or 30 days? Uh, I think we decided on 25. Oh, or maybe... 25 days. We're going to have 25 days to complete that goal. We've got six goals. I believe Gavi Sauce has them written down for us because I, I, I don't do. remember things. Ow, I'm getting Being hurt. Twin Enderman. I am? You are, yes. Oh. Where did he even come from? Behind? Ow, that hurt. Uh, we really do. I was not prepared for him. Uh, blah, 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 blah. He's going to kill me. Go away. Do you have a, um, a bucket of water on you? I do not. Okay. Well, then I'm going to have to do this a really old-fashioned, very sketchy staircase style. Um, yeah. Don't watch. Except I'm not. those of you who are watching, because then, yeah. This is I'm where the trying to entertain this dragon. I'm entertaining a dragon. And it's not going well. Keep keep trying. Um, trying to build up oh. in a very unsafe manner. In the great words of the T Rex from Meet the Robinsons, he's over beside you. That were that was not the great words. In the great uh. words of the dinosaur, the Tyrannosaurus Rex from Meet the Robinsons. I don't know how well this plan was thought through. Um, not very well. I thought you were going to say I have a big head and little arms, but you know. Well, that goes right along their, with it. To each their own quotes. Um, yeah. He's down here beside me. I'm going to start trying to use my sword. Ow, ow, ow. Is that not working out so well for you? No, I've got two hearts. Oh, no, that's not working out too well for you. Uh... Why don't you go back underground and try and get his attention that way? Uh, I mean, <laughs> thank you, thank you for say it for like doing this, because uh, otherwise I would actually I'm doing pretty good. Long time I'm attacking ago. him. Oh, good. Uh, that's a that's a major bonus at this moment. His health isn't really going down at all because he keeps flying away yeah. to reach a free gen. But oh, okay. Well, we're Why they here. gave us the 1.9 dragon in a game that doesn't even run 1.8 yet? Did you um, happen to bring a um, uh, uh, a pickaxe? I did not, and I cannot find the dragon. He scares me. Uh, all right, I I know. I know now yep. that exactly what I must do. Um, and uh, guess what? He's after me. Nope. Worse news. He's after you? Well, yeah. Uh oh, what, what's hitting me? What's hitting me? Bad news. Oh. <laughs> uh huh. That's, uh, that's a really bad news. Because I'm breaking iron bars with my fist. Well, I'm going to go ahead and grab a pickaxe. And I'm mm -hmm. going to come join you again. I was going to say, I was say, the pickaxe isn't really going to do you much good. Oh! Oh! Okay, uh, that's, uh, so the last one is down. But, um, he is still very much alive. Oh, and he's shooting at me. And I have half a heart. Alright, right now would be a really good time for me to start getting down this staircase. Right now would be a really, really, really good time for me to start getting down this staircase as quickly, but as carefully as humanly possible. Um, well, if you see my stuff along the way, I'd, I'd appreciate you grabbing it. Where, where did you die? Oh, there you are. I, I see. I got it. Yep, yep. I got it. Ah, uh, there's the witch hut. Run that way. Let's say you should check and see if the witch is actually in there, and if not, uh, um, uh, just kind of run away or run past it. Well, actually, or I could run past it either way. Okay, so all of his things are broken now. Uh, I'm trying to remember. Oh, okay, there's our little house. I'm going to go back down underneath, and uh, I will have your stuff ready for you there. All right, I am at like the a, swamp. 
and jungle. All right. Uh huh. Maybe. So, as you all can probably tell, defeating the Ender Dragon will not be on our list of things to do in our series. Yes, uh, especially since it's taken us this long just to get this far, and we're still clearly not prepared. Uh, but, for the record, this is the 1.9 Dragon, so it's kind of hard to be prepared for it. True. I would agree with you. Right. But that is not going to be one of our quests, at least for the first season. Yeah, we are so. planning on doing multiple different ones, but uh, for the moment... At the moment, would you like to go ahead and tell them the uh, six quests we have picked out? Uh, sure. Um, we, we can go over them again when we uh, get everything ready and started. Okay, uh, let me just find that little... I have all of it written down here. And, okay, so, first potential quest is uh, collect one Wither Skull, which, considering how un believably dangerous the nether is i believe that is probably the most dangerous and powerfully just deadly thing that we could have uh, reasonably done for ourselves as our first take and both of us being kind of not minecraft noobs um so with, collect one with that being skull. said uh, we we spent a lot of time in the nether on this server and we have killed easily i would say 50 at least 50 uh, wither skeletons. I would agree with that. It's probably a, a fair estimation. And have yet to come across one skull. Yes. Uh, so they're just as hard to find as they always were, only the uh, the nether itself is about a thousand times more deadly. Uh, by the yes. way, if I try, if I, if I, I mean, well, let's just see if I can drop it or if I fly across the room at you. All right. All right. Where's your <laughs> nether pearl? And then leggings, and helmet, and chest plate, and boots, and did you have any food? I had like eight, seven or eight potatoes, I think. Okay. Um, and I'll give you about half these arrows. And... Um, oh, and your torches. I forgot about that. Okay, so. yeah, I'm really more or less worried about my bow. We're going to need that bow. Uh, there's your sword, and okay. your bow, Alrighty. and arrows, good, and good, good. your torches, and your food. Right. Two potatoes. Mm -hmm. Oh, those, those just look like the best potatoes in all the world. I know, they're just delicious, aren't they? I'm, I'm going to save those for later, if you don't mind. Oh, okay. Does that mean you want other potatoes? Yeah, I would like some baked potatoes. Those those oh. sound like they'd hit the spot a little better at the moment. Fine. Some people just can't. Beggars can't be choosers. Didn't your mother ever teach you that? Nope. I did. Right. Take it or leave it. Back to this thing. Um, yeah. It went. And on to challenge number two in our quest. Uh, challenge, challenge number two is a little bit more... Uh, it's probably a lot easier. Oh, stink. But um, also has the potential to take a long time. Uh, the challenge number two is build 25 iron golems. Okay, that could uh, take some time. So 25 Oops. times 9... Go is something around four well it's 425 um iron ingots which Come is on. a lot more iron than oh no that's yeah no oh. so it's four times 25 it's a lot of iron it's uh that's for a very small world so actually no that's uh that's 200 no it's 2500 iron Nothing on a day like today, right? Yeah, I hit it, finally. Glad you did. I'm not getting. I'm not having much luck at all. He needs to come down here and shoot some fire. Have to lead your shots a little bit. Oh, not that much. 
Yes, okay. And... No. Challenge number three. Uh, don't get hit by fireballs. Uh, challenge number three is name an one. Enderman. That sounds fun. We because yeah. there is only one way to get a name tag. Yep. Ow. Okay, don't get hit by those. Those hurt. A little bit. Um. One way to get a name tag that includes us. Ow. Not sure what hat there. Uh, finding a temple or possibly finding a uh, strong stronghold uh, all kinds of different things that are not easy to find mm -hmm. a dungeon uh, getting a name tag going to the nether unfortunately yeah and going and finding a fortress well not fast enough finding a and after that we still have to build an anvil to name it. Yep. Find an Enderman, which has proven to be a little difficult. It took us many, many days on here to find all the pearls we needed. Mm -hmm. To find this place. Uh-oh. Um, then even I, longer just to... I have an Enderman very, very angry with me. Alright. Took us even uh, longer to find all the pearls we needed to open up the portal. I mean, it is just a pain. So that is definitely a legit challenge for us. Mm, challenge. That was challenge number three, I believe. What's challenge yep. number four? Uh, challenge number four is find the end. Oh, Which lovely. is basically just as easy as the last one. Uh, it took there. us... Where'd it go? Giant entirely crack. way too long to find the end. Entirely. Um, I'm down to nine arrows. I don't know how many I have. I don't think it's that many. I'm gonna wait till he comes back down to start shooting fire at us. I, I would uh, oh, that practice. Oh, oh. Oh, that hits you, Alan. Ow! Ow! That stuff hurts. That's the idea. Challenge number five. Uh, collect collect one block of every ore in the game. Not one ore block, but nine individual ingots or jar gems, whatever the case might be, um, resulting in, you know, uh, a completed block of that ore or gemstone. So, and I'm out of arrows. I'm out of arrows as well. But I have sword and I can kill him! I killed him! Good job. Such a beautiful sight. Auto saving. And we only lost one person in the doing of it. May he and rest with that, challenge number six. Uh, challenge number six is collect 20 Ender Pearls. Dear Lord, why did we do so much with Enderman? I don't know. It is going to be. I think that should be the name. I think we'll leave the egg there for the moment. Yeah. Until we get a special place built for it back in the real world. Yeah. I'm not actually really sure how to get it off there. I'm glad somebody knows because, well, actually, I, yeah, yeah. It's, you have to do a piston and a t you have to do a piston and a torch and all kinds of weird stuff like that. Yeah. Yes. It's it's annoying, but worth so, it. So I think season number one of Lost in Minecraft shall be named End of Ends, or we will come up with a title I'll involving it, the end. Yes, well, maybe. I mean, we could get the Wither Skull, we could get the Iron Golems, we could get the block of all the ores, or something like that, so... Um, true. Very true. It's uh, kind of a toss-up. How many levels did you get, by the way? I'm up to level 63. I'm 59, okay. But I had 23 levels to start with, so... I had three. Um, so <laughs> Shall we jump back through? Uh, I was going to say, let's, let's kind of leave, leave that as the end, and... Uh, literally the end um, <laughs> as we jump as we jump back through uh, we'll kind of cut off, cut off the video um, that sounds good to me all right so, so any uh, final remarks um, uh, you can take my land but you can't take my freedom no no can't do that um, do, 
I don't really have any final remarks here. Uh, yes, actually, make sure to check out both of our channels because there's two different perspectives. We will kind of do some different stuff, which will actually be kind of how the series itself goes. Um, oh, yeah. We will be not be together the whole time. We will separate, go our different ways just to collect different things. Quite, quite frequently, in fact, that's probably actually going to be one of the main focuses of it, that more is accomplished through two people than through one. Um, and I may or may not spend part of my time that I'm supposed to be doing something else building a house. But that's uh, entirely speculation at this point. These episodes should, as far as we know, be uploaded weekly on both of our channels. We will have description or a link to each other's page in the description mm -hmm. on each video. They will be uploaded. Most likely, what do you think? Every Sunday? Uh. Well, because the plan is to record on one Sunday, yeah. and then we can record the next episode the next Sunday and upload the one that we recorded the previous. That gives us a week to edit because we both leave pretty busy schedules. Gabby's also more so than I do. Very busy. So that gives us plenty of time to edit and work our magic. Mm -hmm. uh, we also don't necessarily have a, an official start date nailed down for this yet, as this has gone almost an hour at this point. Um, it'll be interesting to see how well this, these videos, this video turned out. Um, yes. Hopefully, at least one of ours is uh, watchable. So. We're both uh, working with technology that is long past its life cycle. Yes. So it has caused many, many, many complications in the process of doing this, but at the same time, we are doing our best to get it out to you because, well, we're excited about doing it, and I hope you're excited about watching it. Yes. So, in the meantime, uh, hopefully this is a nice teaser for you, a nice way to sort of introduce the idea, and... Um, if you are interested, of course, go check, not only check out, but subscribe to both of us. Um, and I've just thought of a question of the day. Oh, dear. What uh, challenges would you like to see put into the Lost in Minecraft? Oh, that's actually really good. Uh, I was afraid I was afraid for a second. But, um, Leave that in the comments below on my and Gabby Sauces, and uh, who knows? Your question or your answer... Your challenge could be our next challenge for Lost in Minecraft. Yeah. Anything that we don't end up doing will probably get carried over to the next to the following season. Well, unless yeah, there's something like really, really good, and then we'll start bumping other like, lane things off. But, uh, yeah. They so, will yeah. be completely randomized when we actually put them in. So, mm -hmm. if yours does not get picked for the first one, then there is a very good possibility it'll be picked for the next one. I'm inside of you, but that's okay. <laughs> yeah. It's not the first time this episode. <laughs> <laughs> probably won't be the first time this series. Yeah, well, probably won't be the last for sure. But, um, yeah. Anyway, uh, like I said, thank you all for watching. Do not do remember to go to both channels. Uh, Kuya over there is uh, doing all kinds of fun stuff. I don't know what game you're doing right now as far as a Let's Play. Currently, I'm doing Shovel Knight. It's a blind playthrough. And oh. Gabby Sauce is doing a game I had never heard of, but I'm very interested in now. Um, yep, I'm doing an older game from 2003 called Beyond Good and Evil. Uh, it's really a cult following game. Uh, still hashtag BG and E uh, Mark II because we really want a sequel, but we'll probably never get it because Ubisoft hates us. But that's another story. Um, anyway, uh, I think that can finish it off. Thank you very much for watching. Am I uh, right on this? I think so. All right. So the way I end up with every episode I do is have fun, be good, and we'll see you all next time. Goodbye.